Second possession for the Skens. First and ten at their own 26 mark. Griffin looking up top for Gary Clark. And Clark has it complete in Falcons territory. A 41-yard pass from Griffin to Clark, and he beat Tim McHire. And we're just going to see a case of who can get the best position and who wants this ball the worst because both these guys have a chance to catch this ball. This is not a particularly well-thrown ball. It's underthrown. Look at this. Both guys going for it. 8.44 left in the first quarter play. Atlanta on top, 3-0. Complete to Sanders, and Sanders looks to be close to the first down. Scott Case on the stop. Play action. Griffin going for Terry Orr. Touchdown, Washington. I'm going to boost the point after, and Washington answers back to take a 7-3 lead over Atlanta. Middleton, motion out of the backfield, or coming all the way over from the left-hand side. Tuggle chasing him late. Tuggle badly beaten in the corner for a red skin touchdown. First and 10 for Atlanta, and it's own 15, Pat Casey. Malone back from the red gun tackle. Billy Joe Collins number one of the afternoon for the Skins, 25th of the year for Washington. Second and six. Rip to pass. Complete to Monk for the first down. And Art Monk right now taking Tim McHire to school. Because Rippin rolling to his left, which is a good strong move for a guy that throws from the right side, just guns this thing. And 10. Monk in motion. Back to Monk again for the first down. And Art Monk, the future Hall of Famer, showing why. Ryan Jordan finally on the tackle. A 12 yard pass play from Rippin to Monk. Tim McHire is beginning to become one of the main leaders in the Art Monk fan club because Monk is showing him exactly how this game should be played by a wide receiver. It's played quietly, and it's played well. From the 39, first and 10. Play action. Going up top, looking for Clark. He's got it. Touchdown, Washington. Tim McHire got absolutely blistered there. Low Miller makes it 14-3 Washington with 7.28 left in the first half of play. He had this play earlier, and Joe Gibbs went back to it again. He's got Gary Clark working from the right side of the screen, one-on-one -on -one with Tim McHire. And he is five yards behind him. That was a real fry job there by Gary Clark on Tim McHire. Third and four. Irving, the lone back. Sanders in motion. Here comes Scott Case. Going for Monk, and it's complete for the first down across midfield. And again, Tim McHire defending. A 32-yard pass play from Mark Rippon. They're bringing their full blitz, getting after Rippon. 
and they're going to hit him, but that hit is at a price. Because Tim McHire getting a little old, but he's trailing another receiver, and this time it was Art Monk. First and 10, Washington at Atlanta, 47. Three tight ends. Play action. Going for Terry Orr. He's got it. Out of bounds at the 10. Gary Orr with his second catch of the day. And that's an end goal. And Rippin with the naked boot takes it in for the score. Touchdown, Washington. aggressive defense goes after the ball wrong guys the balls with number 11 watch the linebackers watch the line everybody diving over the top coming after the running back boy what a good sell by mark Rippon. excellent job taking advantage of an over eager atlanta defense and this is no time for the redskins to relax they got to pour it on here because atlanta has the capabilities of scoring quickly and second and three Complete to Pritchard for the first down across midfield. Fumble recovered by the Skins, A.J. Johnson. And Johnson gets it back to the 47, tackled by Andre Risen. running free doesn't know there's somebody behind him what's that guy thinking i'm gonna poke this ball out watch this ball right there heads up play ball comes ripped out ball comes loose johnson's right there that's an easy one for johnson that's a gimme and credit to andre rising who comes back here to make this tackle otherwise you're talking six points Wilson pulling his way through the rookie out of Michigan State. Oh, the fumble. Really going to feel this fumble. First down, Rich. Randy, now that is a big wow. A fumble is what was ruled on the field. Watch the ball. It snapped. It dropped. That was a fumble, but was there an offside initially? Let's take another look at it. If they didn't call offside, which they didn't against Wilson, that's a correct call. That is a fumble. Griffin going for Clark. Touchdown. There is a flag on the play. Back at the 17. And we'll await the call, but it's going to be against Atlanta. Defensive holding. So the play stands as Gary Clark turns Bobby Butler and scores in the end zone. And Low Miller. Boots Washington in front by the score of 28 to 3, and indeed, capital punishment is most appropriate. And you saw the executioner right here, Mark Rippon. If this is capital punishment, at least it's painless because it's quick. One more time, you're going to see an unescorted Gary Clark coming free in the end zone here. Somebody messed up big time because one of the hundreds of people on the sidelines here were the nearest defenders to Gary Clark on that one. All Washington in the first half, 28 to 3. The 25, first and 10, Billy Joe Tolliver with time to pass. Looking for Haynes, he's got him.
touchdown, Atlanta, a 75-yard pass play, a quick strike from Billy Joe Tolliver to Michael Haynes. Billy Joe Tolliver did not have a bad first half. It's his receivers that let him down. But right here, Mayhew takes a chance at a dive. And it's all Haynes from there, who just glides into the end zone. Kelly Goodburn at his own two. Ryan Jordan from the 44. And roped from behind by Sidney Johnson. Alkins one of six third down conversion. Oliver with time. Throws it complete to Haynes for the first down and more. Inside the 15, finally stopped by Martin Mayhew. A 30-yard pass play from Billy Joe Tolliver to Michael Haynes. First and 10 at Washington, 15. Touchdown, Atlanta, Andre Risen. had to tell that team anything he had to tell them look guys you're a lot better than you're showing right now just do what you do best and this is what the red gun offense does best and it's good so the Falcons have cut into the Redskins lead with two touchdowns the Redskins lead it now 28 17 Ryan Mitchell from his own five across the 20 the 30. And Mitchell tripped up around the 38-yard line by Norm Johnson. A 35-yard return by Brian Mitchell. Gerald Riggs. The back and the ball carrier and has the first down. He's rocking. Dragged down at the 25 by Brian Jordan. And there is a flag at the point of the tackle. Probably a face mask. It looked like that right arm was flailed in there by Scott Case. Could have been a face mask. Watch this hole open up. Left side, Donaldson, 42, gets kicked out by Terry Orr. And now there is nothing in front of Riggs but that goal line. Great job of effort by Jordan to get there, but you saw that right arm come in there and just rake right over the face mask of Gerald Riggs. We'll see it another time. Shelly's not going to catch him. Jordan's got the angle. Look at that hand. He's grabbing anything he can get to bring Riggs down there. Third and 11. Ball at the 19. 10-19. Left in the third quarter play. Irvin, the lone back. On a clock. Touchdown, Washington. Art Mook. And there is a flag. against Mitchell, number 36, on interfering with Monk in the end zone. Six catches for 100 yards on the afternoon for Art Monk. And Low Miller makes it 35-17, Washington. Well, we talked about the importance of not having Deion Sanders in there. Well, they picked on Tim McHire, and there's Art Monk using that double move we talked about. Mitchell was all over him. Marshall, sack. Third sack of the afternoon for Washington. Here comes Wolver right here, working against that left side of the Falcons line. Sims, the rookie, gets off late, looks a little confused as to who exactly it is he has. He gets some hands on him, but that's about it. Pretty much unimpeded. Tolliver complete to Risen for the first down at the 32. Andre Risen. Second and nine. 
Weaver just gets rid of it. Is it caught? Or intercepted? Touchback. Excellent job on the part of Al Boyd May. We talk about defensive backs having to have a short memory. Mays called for holding on the last play. Works in front of Pritchard there, gets between Pritchard and the ball this time, and makes a very acrobatic catch. Faked out Billy Joe Tolliver because he thinks he's got a touchdown. Look at that reaction. Nope. Sorry, Billy Joe. Interception. Second and 12 from the 18. Griffin, going up top the clock. He's open. He's got him. It's a foot race. I think that was that knockout punch we mentioned just a while earlier. They had him set up. They lowered the guard, and that right cross over the top. Bang. 42-17. Washington. From the ground level. Watch this thing happen after the catch. Gary Clark cleanly beats Elbert Shelley. Now it's the race. Shelley gets his shot. He can't trip him up. Case gets his shot, he can't get him. And he's got one guy in the background rooting for him hard. And that's the guy that threw him the pass. Mark Rippon having a career day. Five touchdowns, 378 yards. And it has been punishment by the Washington Redskins. They've done everything right so far today against the Atlanta Falcons team. From the 36. Third looking for Muck. Muck with the move. He's open. Flag on the play. Muck heading for Painter. Touchdown, Washington. There is a flag on the play. That'll be holding on Mitchell. I think that score is going to count. And if it stands, it'll be a 64-yard touchdown pass from Griffin to Muck. It's been that kind of a season for Mark Griffin. Redskin record six touchdowns. Well, going into this game, you hadn't heard much posse talk, but I got a funny feeling you're going to hear a lot more about this posse. You saw Mitchell fall on the ground 36 after he had bumped illegally on Monk, and Monk just keeps right on going. Ball to 27 of Washington, first and 10 for Atlanta, 6:34 left in the game. And it's recovered by Stokes. Brett Barr, the rookie out of Southern Mississippi, won the game for the Falcons from their own 12. Barr. And it's intercepted by Andre Collins. Touchdown, Washington. Second interception of the season for Collins. Well, Brett Favre, did you ever have the Redskins on your schedule at Southern Mississippi? Wow. Welcome to RFK and the NFL. Good job of concentration by Andre Collins as Favre throws this ball in there. Tries to zip it into Pritchard. Ball slips through his hand. Pritchard, he's trying the best he can to pull down big Andre, but Andre will not be denied. Second left. This will be it. And intercepted 
by Sidney Johnson. The third interception of the afternoon for the Skins. They have 20 on the season. So here in Washington, our final score, once again, Washington 56, Atlanta 17.